before I get started, let me just say that I hope you like, comment, subscribe. Ah, I just always wanted to say that. <laughs> Who was that? I don't know. Hi guys, welcome to my channel, A Chosen Cover Girl. OMG, I'm so excited because this is my very, 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 very first YouTube video. Woo! If you're thinking about doing it, do it! I did, it's my first video. You're never too late. I'm all about the, the belief that delay does not mean denied. So I'm really, really, really big on timing. And um, there's always room on the table for you. Don't let anybody make you feel like, oh, it's oversaturated or anything like that. Shoo. Just come, come, do it with me. Like, let's make it our journey together. Like post a video like tomorrow or something or or later on today so we can like do this thing to get together. And you can like send me a comment and be like, girl, it's my first day too. And then we can just like. Oh <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm laughing because my 11 year old is my director and she is really just not liking what I'm saying right now. And she just swears that she just knows exactly how to do it because she's watched a million videos. And she's like, hi guys, this is, this I'm is like, the I like that. Directors don't interrupt. Okay. How rude. The show must go on. Okay, so guys, seriously, who am I and what is this channel about? I am Daniela. Um, I'm an attorney. I am a wife for 14 years now. Before um, I got married, I was one of those girls that were like, oh my God, oh my God, woe is me. When am I going to get married? And I used to cry and sob and write in my journal every night about how I just wanted the Lord to send me a man and all this other stuff. And then I used to cry about the fact that my crushes didn't like me. They always liked somebody else. And I was like, oh my God, who would I have to be, Lord God? Why don't they want me? And one night when I was writing in my journal, the Lord was like, girl, I think that's how he said it. He was like, girl, I like, why are you looking for a man to validate you? I already chose you. Beloved, I chose you from the beginning. You are mine and I am yours. He just went on about how he loves me and how he went to the cross for me and how he I'm his cover girl. His blood covers me. How um, I am everything to him and how I'm fearfully and wonderfully made in his image. Pause. I was so tired of hearing fearfully and wonderfully made in the image of the Lord. I feel bad. I don't want to say it's cliche, but I got tired of hearing it because I was still single. I still wanted a man. I was still in them streets by myself. So being fearfully and wonderfully made just didn't do it for me until it did it for me. And when it did, when I got a hold of that word and it really sunk and resonated in my spirit, oh Lord, you could, oh Lord, you couldn't tell me nothing. Mm -mm. I walked with this newfound boldness and confidence and faith and I was like, yes, I am a child of God, honey. And whoever comes in step to me better come correct because I am all that and a bag of chips. So after I had this new, you know, this confidence and this, this, and I walked with this new anointing, uh, the Lord was like, okay, okay, you get it now. You get it, boo. So that gave birth to a chosen cover girl. Like just all of it. I walked with this joy. I walked with faith. I walked with confidence. And so again, he was like, okay, you get it now. You get it now. So what I want you to do is I want you to tell my other cover girls that they're mine and I'm theirs. I want you to share the message so they can also walk in confidence. They can also walk with this new boldness and anointing and know who they are and to whom they belong. So he's like, go ahead, all them little journals, the journal entries, and you was over there crying and boohooing. I want you to tap into those emotions. And every lesson that I taught you during that season, I need you to write it down and I need you to share it. That gave birth to my book, Secrets of an Undiscovered Good Thing, A Church Girl's Search for Love and the Lessons She Learned Along the Way. And 14 years later, here I am. I have a husband. I have two kids, a girl, an 11-year-old who is 
behind this camera right now helping me direct this video love her to death and i have an eight-year-old son who is a preemie he was born three months early 27 weeks he was two pounds 12 ounces and i talk about the struggles um during that period when i didn't know he was gonna live or whether he was going to have significant medical issues like this channel is about your everyday christian living life full of joy, full of confidence, full of faith, despite the challenges and sometimes tr not joyful, sometimes not confident, sometimes not faithful. And in every role that we play as a, as a mom, as a student, as a single woman who's waiting for her man to come along, you know, it's about the struggles and the challenges that we face. And one of those challenges would be the fact that I almost, my marriage almost did not make it through COVID. Like we almost did not get through COVID we we were pretty much done but we did it we made it through so we're here to talk about the wins the victories that comes with this thing called life the fact that covid didn't take my marriage and i'm here to share it like i am transparent af guys like it gets me in trouble with my husband sometimes because i'm going to share the issues that we had and how we got through it i truly believe that you know, we're here to share our stories. So other people can be like, okay, if they did it, then, you know, they got through it, then we can get through it too. Like whatever the issue may be. And I'm going to tell you, there's going to be times when I'm sharing my story and my husband's going to come for me because he's very private. He doesn't like people to know his business like that. But I'm like, okay, well, your business is mostly my business. And I'm okay with telling my business. So there you go. So anytime I let you guys know, ooh, he might not like this, he's gonna come for me. I need you guys to like, 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 comment, share, engage as much as possible. I'm gonna have the receipts for him and I'm gonna like, babe, this is getting a lot of engagement. Babe, people are really, really receiving the message here. I'm like, babe, do you not see this? So I, I have to remind him, like, it's not about us. It's about the glory of God. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Again, I'm transparent. I'm not a biblical scholar. I'm not a teacher and I'm not a preacher. I'm a storyteller. And I truly believe, I truly believe that we're not here to hoard our stories, our testimonies. We're here to share it. So once again, people can know, okay, they got through it. I can go get through it. Or, wow, if the Lord did that for her, then surely he can do the same for me because he's not a respecter of persons. So, again, this channel is, is to edify each other. I'm here to share my story. And please, guys, know this. I can be so absent-minded sometimes. Like, it's a little embarrassing. Or I can be easily distracted and, like, maybe my son or my daughter or something can just get me just distract me and I'll just totally forget where I left off and then I'll move on. And if it was something that you really wanted me to finish, just go ahead and mention it in a comment. I'll respond. Or if it's like something really important that I think I need to share with others, then I'll just go ahead and mention it in the next video. So again, like, comment, share, subscribe, put your notification on because I'm here every week. And on weeks where I'm feeling a little overzealous, I might be here twice a week. And I'm all about sharing my family. Like, I want you guys to be a part of my life. I'm excited about sharing who I am with you and learning more about you guys. And I'm going to have some video blogs here. So, yeah, I'm here for it. I hope you're here for it. And I just want to leave you with exactly my mission statement, what a chosen cover girl is. She is a woman who lives life full of joy, confidence, and faith because she knows who she is and to whom she belongs. She doesn't require the validation of man because she's been chosen by God. So in other words, she knows her worth. And she knows that with the Lord by her side, she can conquer anything that tries to hinder her from her destiny. So cover girls, I look forward to seeing you next week. Bye. I am a wife for 14 years now. I've been married to my husband, uh, who I met in undergrad. And I will tell you this, before I... This is...
<laughs> that is rude. Uh, how dare you? Uh, shh, you're interrupting my video. No, like seriously. Okay. Okay. So, as I was saying before, I was rudely interrupted. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Hey guys. Like, I'm not trying to be fake, though. If you came across this video, you are one, you are one of the lucky chosen, you are chosen out of it.